protesters clash with deputies in Victorville. This comes after a brawl at a high school football game where a teenage girl was reportedly body slammed by a deputy. Hello and thank you for joining us. You're watching Eyewitness News at 5 live on ABC 7 Hulu and wherever you stream. I'm Jory Rand and I'm Michelle Fisher. Parents protesting against the deputies actions at the sheriff's station today. Another teen was arrested after punching a deputy in the face. Let's go to Eyewitness News reporter Amy Powell live with those breaking developments. Amy. Well, Jory and Michelle, the parents of two teenagers are very upset about the actions taken by one of the sheriff's deputies who responded to the fight at Victor Valley High School, accusing him of using excessive force. Now, protesters gathered to demonstrate outside the Victorville Police Department today, a disturbance erupting when some in the crowd got into altercations with deputies. At least a couple of people seen being detained after confronting and shoving officers. Now, this is all related to the brawl Friday evening after a football game at Victor Valley High School. Multiple fights broke out. According to authorities, a deputy fired pepper balls to disperse the crowd, and a 16-year-old girl grabbed the pepper ball launcher. Now, the violent confrontation that followed was captured on cell phone video. We can tell you that video shows a deputy grabbing the teen and slamming her to the ground. A police say during the encounter, a 16-year-old boy punched a deputy in the face, other deputies taking him into custody. His mother is angry, saying he did nothing wrong sending eyewitness news photos showing injuries that she says were caused when the deputy punched her son in the face. Now, the mother of the 16-year-old girl also sent us photos. She says her daughter was hospitalized for treatment. That mother says she arrived at the school during the brawl. Because I pulled in and I saw my daughter on the floor, and at that moment, I didn't know if she was dead or what was going on with her. And I looked up and I seen that they had her son and he was just punching him on the face. I never got a call from them or anything saying that they were arrested my son, even though he's a minor. Um, I still, at this point, don't know where my son is. Uh, the San Bernardino County Sheriff's Department says the teenage boy was arrested and booked at Juvenile Hall. The entire incident remains under investigation. Reporting live, Amy Powell, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.